A final goodbye this morning. Hundreds of people coming together to lay a Northeast High School football player to rest. Jacquez Welch's family designing this special program to honor his love for the game. They called this the Sports Illustrated inspired cover, the Heavenly Edition. ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee was there for the service. Inside the walls of First Baptist Church, we come today with bowed heads and humble hearts. Remembering Jacquez Welch is priority. Man, I spent Christmas with him, birthdays, everything with him. Jacquez was one of my closest friends that turned into my brother. And I ain't gonna never forget him. His best friend, Corey Tate, struggling to imagine his life without Welch. Vikings head coach Jeremy Freud urging friends and family to live like he did. You won't let people outwork you. You won't let, you won't make excuses. You'll find a way to get things done in his name and in his honor. Welch collapsed on the Northeast High School football field two weeks ago from an undiagnosed medical condition. His parents and siblings clutching each other as they too wonder what comes next. Minds are uneasy, hearts are broken, uh, and it's going to take some time. Reverend Benjamin Adams reminding people to help ease the family's pain by supporting them. He says today's service proved the impact Welch had on the community. We were all here together and we were all here for one purpose. And I believe that it became a symbol for what this world should look like. In St. Petersburg, Heather Lee, ABC Action News.